Hello and welcome to Basingstoke. Ba Basingstoke. Basingstoke. Basingstoke? I don't know. Um, how's it going, everyone? Uh, we're back with a new series. Uh, this little game called Welcome to Basingstoke, as you can see, clearly. Uh, this is a game that I've been following for a while. Not since, I think it was first announced somewhere in like 2014. I'm not 100% sure on that. I didn't know about it in 2014. Um, but uh, recently, within the last year or so, I saw this and I thought, you know, that, that, that looks pretty interesting. It's like a survival-esque type game, but, um, you know, unlike most survival games, uh, especially zombie survival games, I, I don't think you're not like, you know, a one-man Arnold Schwarzenegger, Rambo, uh, Jason Statham rolled into one with, you know, enough guns to put the local militia to shame. I think the actual gist of this game is that you you actually do have to survive and not just murder everything. It's the zombie apocalypse, not an apocalypse of zombies, if you will. Um, so it, it already intrigues me because there might be some interesting gameplay elements there. And uh, but it, it also looks like there's going to be a lot of carnage too. Um, you know, there's there's plenty of weapons to be had. So we'll see kind of what the balance of power is there. Um, Basingstoke is actually a real town in southern England, which is kind of cool. I checked it out, you know, because it's. Uh, it's interesting to me. It's actually like, it has like 80,000 people that live in this town, which is nuts. I thought like all the uh, English towns had like 100 or so, you know, like Hamlets, you know? I watch BBC. I know what an English town is all about. <laughs> um, let's also get another elephant out of the room, and I'll click on the options here so we have something else to look at. Uh, yes, so... I know there's still a little bit of doubt in the air out there. People were still a little confused, but um, I'm actually not British at all. Not even, like, a little bit. Um, I'm very much a Midwesterner, uh, unfortunately. Got the Midwesterner accent. It's probably never going to leave. I can't actually do a British accent at all because I don't really enunciate very well. And you need to, you need to be able to, to really get that crisp delivery if you're going to pull off a British accent. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Now that we got that cleared up, let's <laughs> take a look at the options. All right, so in the game, actually before, I didn't record this, but before you get into this intro screen, it actually tells you a little bit about the types of scary things that are going to happen in the game. So there's a lot of flashing lights. If you're epileptic, you definitely should never play any video game ever, much less, you know, this one. Um, there's, you know, obviously there's a scary monster. There's one right on the title screen. That's scary. And uh, there's there's some gore. Uh, so they warn you about that, and you can turn it off, but, eh, come on, I'm, I'm an adult, I can handle it. Uh, I, helpful pop-up hints when you find new stuff, I guess we'll leave that on. I, I really don't want to run the risk of turning all, everything off. I am coming into this blind. I should probably, uh, mention that now. If you're new to the channel, welcome, thank you for checking me out. Uh, it sounded wrong, sorry. Um, this is, as with all the playthroughs on this channel, this is going to be blind. I have really no idea. I saw like a little bit of gameplay, but aside from that, I really don't know much about it, aside from its general description. So we'll leave the hints on, just so I don't look like a complete idiot. Uh, instant death replay, this sounds really cool. I like this. They reduce graphical performance, that's not a problem. Crafting alert, hint, notification message whenever available crafting recipes changes. All right, sounds good. Show noise radius. Is this like a cheater type thing? Show ring around avatar indicating your noise detection radius. You know what? Let's um, let's turn that off, and let's also turn aim assist off because I think this is for if you're using a controller, and I am not going to use a controller. I was tempted, I was thinking about it, but I think I'm going to stick with the mouse and keyboard. I, I pretty much, aside from like platformers, I, I generally always use a mouse and keyboard. Um, and then we have look ahead. View tracks the cursor when you to look around for. This also seems like a kind of a handicap type thing, so we'll turn that off. Uh, we just want to be completely caught by surprise by everything and make tons of noise and just wake everybody up. Um, that's kind of how I like to do things in real life and in video games. Alright, so graphics options here, you can see there's not a whole lot. This is what I was talking about though, the reduced flashing and reduced core. These are things that you can do if that suits you. I also turn down the volume a little bit so that it doesn't kill me. Um, and if I need to adjust that in post, I will do that. So keyboard. Alright, let's take a look at the controls so that I actually know them. Uh, so we move around, we can fire and use sneak is shift, that's good, crafting is Q, that's fine, what's E? Weapon, C is melee, reload is R, that's good, torch, ha, <laughs> torch, that's not like an actual torch with like, you know, a stick and some flammable tar or something, 
this is like an actual flashlight. I know this because, again, I've watched BBC, and that's this is what they call flashlights. So I'll, I'll do my best to translate for you guys out there. Um, all right, next item preview. All right, this seems pretty standard issue. I'm fine with that. And that's the control. All right, so that's it for options. Let's get it. This is just taking me way too long. I'm really excited to get into this game, if you can't tell. <laughs> all right, so we have characters. Um, Office Edith. Uh, no bonus items. And it looks like you have to unlock these, which is unfortunate because the guy, the bald guy, the banker with the glasses, I wanted to play as him. But I'm gonna have to, that's, he's probably like down here. I'm gonna have to unlock him. I imagine that uh, there's gonna be a lot of dying here. So I'm not really sure how this series is gonna come together. If it's gonna be just a series of videos of me dying or I'm not really sure how this is gonna work. We're playing it by ear, but um, you know, it's an adventure and we're in this together. So I guess all I can do is play as Office Edith and that's fine. Use one to open the inventory drawer. When red light shows, wait here. Apparently the red light never... Welcome to Omnicore, job interview. Oh yeah, that's right, Omnicore is the, uh, the umbrella, I guess. That's a fancy little vase. Hello, how are you, kind sir? Please take a visitor pass. Wait, I can't read that. What did you say? Oh, yeah, that's the same thing. Take the lift, third floor. Lift, by the way, that's an elevator, for those of you who don't know. Good luck. Thank you. Um, that's kind of gibberish. I was kind of hoping for, like, you know, some cool English accented gibberish. But maybe not. I'm already lost. Did he say take the central lift or something? I don't know. I don't pay attention. Hey, don't worry, they don't bite. Oh, that's nice. Get the little rabbits. This is a fun game. Would you like to feed them? Uh, they love sandwiches. Go get the sandwich. I don't know why you would make an entire sandwich for a rabbit, but I like to play hide and seek with them. Yeah, well, I think you need to get out more. They can hear you running. That's creepy. They're genetically enhanced. Okay, so these are probably going to turn into monsters and, like, want to kill me. I need to get rid of these. Yeah, they're very friendly. Alright, I'm going to pause this for a second because this is still really, really loud. Holy cow. Alright, let's just go... Let's go there. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, apologize. Apologize. We're back. They came from the labs. Am I supposed to, like, read all of this? They can't see far. Is this, like, a tutorial about monsters? Like, when they turn into monsters, I'll have to remember that they like sandwiches. And they can't see very far. This is, like, a tutorial. Alright, well, thanks, buddy. He'll be the first to die, undoubtedly. Wait a minute. I need my visitor pass, please. More rabbits. All right, genetically enhanced rabbits. Lift out of order. Oh boy. Wait, isn't this an elevator? Why is it so dark? This is like a tomb. This would freak me out if... <laughs> Wait a minute, what? Test chamber, all right. Why am I in the test chamber? I thought this was a job interview. This is the weirdest job interview. Uh oh. Uh, am I in the right place? That is, those are really big plugs. Holy cow. Impressive, isn't it? Yes, I wish I was in there though. It seems safer in there. I have no idea how it works. Then what are you even doing here? <laughs> I just press these buttons. That's a, actually, Probably what I would do. Put me in a lab with buttons, and I'm gonna press them. Pretty much all of them. Shouldn't you be in the control room? Yeah. I, I don't know. <laughs> I'm supposed to be interviewing for a job. What are these? In use? Hazmat. Great. So there's no hazmat suits. What is up with the weird stuff going on here? 
I feel like Edith, the office worker, is um, contamination detected. What? Edith, what happened? What's going on here? Help me out. Okay, decon. Oh no. I don't, I can't see, I don't know what's going on. This game does not screw around. It just throws you right into a huge mess. Okay, that's, that's bright, even for me. Machine guns, all right, so everything's already gone to hell. Oh, whoa, hey. I don't, oh God, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to get out of here? I can't leave, nope, explosions. Stay away from the walls, stay away from the glass. Just stand in the middle and cover your eyes. Can I get out? It's very dark. I have my visitor pass still. <laughs> oh no. Okay, see that guy's dead. This guy's dead. People are dead now. That's that's not good. All right, what's in here? Is there a sneak button? Yes. Shh. Okay, I'm done sneaking. Um, well, we can't go back this way, can we? Nope. Oh, did I hurt myself? Do I have a health bar? Okay, don't walk on the fire. Let's let's be smart about this. These guys are all. Why did are they all skeletons? What? What is going on in here? Oh wow. They're actually uh, disrespecting your corpses. I apologize, I'm not doing it on purpose. Uh, can I get it in there? <laughs> uh, oh, there's some green arrows that are helpful. They're telling me where to go. I still have my visitor pass. At this point, I feel like it's just not gonna help me at all. And now I feel kind of dumb for throwing all those sandwiches when I should have clearly kept them. All right, all right. Ooh, I found a torch. See, this is a this is a torch. It's a visual representation, so you can follow along with me at home. Lighting. Tap space to turn on and off. Highlights loot, but makes you more visible. All right. Oh, that's cool. We've got our first item. Can I go in here? Oh, is that because I can't go in here? This this Omni Labs door just won't open. It's kind of nifty, I guess. The game not so subtly telling me exactly where to go on no uncertain terms. <laughs> I'm pretty zoomed out right now. I can't really. Okay, this is. Nope, oh, that's not good. That's that's not good either, though. Oh, what is that? No. Okay, let's let's keep it together, Edith. Ooh. There is something out there. Okay, there's somebody that needs help. Oh, that's it. No, don't eat the guy. I, oh wow, holy cow. He uh he definitely did a number on that guy. All right. Oh, I gotta run. I gotta run. There's a guy that's dead. Hazmat suits. These are still in use. Did I just make like a full circle? Wasn't I here already? I hear somebody. What are those things in there? Yeah, that's what I want to know. Can I get a hazmat suit? We have to get out. Yeah, what are you crowding me for? What, what are you doing? Okay. We should hide. Yes. Well, okay. All right. Sausage roll. Mmm. Sausage roll. You just automatically pick stuff up. I wish you guys would give me some personal space. Personal space. Oh, God. Uh, can I? No, I can't. Is there any other loot? Yes, there is. Wow, this is cool. I like this. Sandwich. Sausage roll. Do I have to eat these? Like, am I? Oh, my God. These guys... I would not be... Oh, there's something there. Okay, let's let's get the sandwich. 
Alright. Let's slowly back away. Yeah, well, you know, you're all gonna die with that attitude. That's for sure. Okay, these guys don't have loot, so that's fine. Oh, we have to go that way, don't we? You guys do not shut up, do you? Alright, well, let's grab... Hello? Another sausage roll. Uh, I can't get over there. Alright, uh... Let's... Let's throw this over here. Nope. He does not care about the sandwich. Can I pick the sandwich up? Come on. Come on. Come on. I need you to I need you to come over here, buddy. Come on. There we go. Alright, let's go, guys. Let's go. Come on. Yes, saying keep quiet and then not keeping quiet is a good way to get yourself killed. Okay, we gotta go this way. There's, there's, am I trapped now? Did I just make a mistake? Oh no, oh no, oh no. Hi. Do you want to tag along? I guess. I'm not sure what happened to these guys. They might be dead. Yeah, they're super dead. Let's go. <laughs> Sorry, fellas, but not really. We will need a key card. Well, I have a key card. Well, I have another key card now. Oh, that was a visitor's pass. I suppose that's probably not the same thing. Understood. Okay, what's over here? I hear a lot of stuff that I don't want to hear. Oh, crap. Oh, 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 what the... F that guy's dead. That guy's super dead. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, sausage roll? I don't actually know what's... Maybe they like sausage rolls? Okay, no, we gotta go. We gotta go. Okay, so he... It looked like he liked that. I, I don't know. Okay, unlocking. They automatically do that, interestingly enough. Whoa, alright, let's just... just uh, oh, oh, god. That was me. That's a, that's a mirror. Okay. <laughs> Edith. Welcome to Bazingstoke. Thank you. I'm not feeling very welcome. I'm feeling kind of like, you know... Everything wants to kill me, and or eat me. Although that the first guy that died, the zombie was not interested in eating him. He was just interesting, or interested in destroying him completely. The red lion. Find the key and get to the pub. All right. Well, that sounds good to me. I could use a stiff drink. Oh, wow. Are we going to go outside? All right, let's be quiet here. Picked up loose change. See, I didn't have my flashlight on, so I can still see these. Small purse. I guess I'm unsure of what highlights loot means. Oh, they took my sausage rolls, man. All right, so these are just for throwing, I guess. All right, that, that's fine. That means I don't have... Oh, I do. I still have that. Oh, yeah. I can see down there. Ah. Sausage roll! Yes! Delicious sausage roll. I kind of want to just eat one. Uh-oh. Wheelie bin. Tab for info. Hiding place. Push towards to hide. Look around. Okay. Oh, that's cool. That is cool. Man, imagine this was a first-person game. It'd be amazing. All right, what's going on? Oh, sorry, sorry. All right, I hear, I hear stuff. Yep, there he is. We're very, ooh, tab for info. Kills you in one hit. I mean, everything does, doesn't it? Prowler, alien inside? Slow moving, weak, often hunts in packs, weaker from behind, sometimes has loot. I don't think I'll be killing any of these because I don't have any weapons. So. These are prowlers, I'm assuming, right? Okay. Uh, 
Okay. Let's go over here. I have a sandwich. I'm wielding a sandwich. <laughs> and, uh... Okay, so what's... I can't... Can I get through here? I can. Cool. These are very tiny cars. So it looks like as long as you're sneaking... What was that? That didn't sound like a prowler. That sounded like something much bigger. See, I want to get over there. All right, Edith. Let's just let's just keep it low, low profile. All right. Oh, what is that? That's another one, right? Another prowler. He just has a helmet. Wonder if that means he's harder to kill. Do these turn on when I get close to them? No. They just randomly flicker. I can't get in here. Darn it. Alright. Alright. Let's just sneak. I'm not going to be able to get through here. Oh, she just jumped over. Wow. That was a nice jump, Edith. Well done. Oh, so many unpleasant things. We need to make it to the pub. I don't know where the pub is. That's a cart. Is there anything I can do with that? I can make noise with it, so that's always good. Danger of death. <laughs> uh, it's a friendly place. Private keep out, yeah. Well. Okay, so we got some loot. Fruit. All right, let's check out the fruit. Can be thrown. Hold to aim. Release the throw tapped. Stuns an enemy. Part of one crafting recipe. Enemies don't like fruit. All right. Cool. So we can stun guys with that. I'm going to try to hang on to the really useful things. Who's change? That's interesting. So we're going to rack up some dough here and then hopefully spend it somewhere. Hey, it's a, an officer of the law. Well, not anymore. He's just a bloodthirsty alien now. Loose change. Yep. All right. So it looks like we're relatively safe here. The red lion pub key. That's good. We need that. Hmm. Is there a map in this game? I don't think so. Yes, there is. Of course there is. Uh... So that's a recycle bin that we can hide out in. It looks like we need to go this way. That seems fine. There's a dog! Somewhere. Alright, let's sneaky sneak. Nails? Oh yes, I am a fan of nails. Was that the bin that I was trying to get into? Uh, also bin. This, this what, what they call a trash can. Just so you know. Just so you're aware. So you can uh, stay with me with the lingo. Making lots of noise. That's good. Where's the dog? Can you have like a little dog buddy? Or is it like Darkwood where all the dogs want to eat you? Okay. Alright, so far so good. Okay, another bin. What's, uh, what's going on here? So the further out we move our cursor, I thought I'd turn this option off, but the further out, maybe it's just a more pronounced effect. But we can kind of get ourselves direction sign, tab for info. Reveals nearby map. Oh, touch to activate. You point towards your destination. Cool. All right. Map updated. That's very video gamey. You found a postcard. Visit Sunny Basingstoke. Uh, that's, that's a postcard? <laughs> Basingstoke Toilets. <laughs> Visit the Basingstoke Toilets. That's a... Uh, interesting. Postcard. A little tongue-in-cheek, I'd wager. Alright, can we move these? We can. I don't know why I care, but um, it's a thing. Um... So that revealed the map, right? Yeah, cool. So there's a bin here. There's a bin here. What is this icon? 
I don't know what it is. We can't go that way, so we have to go through the building. Like, these are blocked off, I, I would assume. That's what that means. So let's go through the building. Is there anything over here? Yeah, that's pleasant. Okay, so there's a guy over there. Let's grab this stuff really quick. Suitcase! Yes! Take this to the campsite. Unlocks extra carry slots for this character class. Excellent, excellent. Oh, I'm on fire. Stop. I I still don't know where my health is. How many more of those can I take? Whoop. Let's turn that off. Oh, that reveal. Okay, so there we go. Some things are just always, like these guys are, were always lit up, but this didn't light up until I, uh, let's tab really quickly, until I put the, shine the torch on it. Totally tubular. Huh? Oh man, so funny. Ingredient cannot be used directly. Part of 16 crafting recipes. Um, pipe bomb, perhaps? Or a uh, melee weapon of sorts? Okay. Slow and steady. Shh. You're making noise. You shouldn't be making noise. Let's see if I can scope out any other bits of loot. Ah, the toilets. Yes, of course. I don't think there's anything alive in here. Or undead or whatever. Excellent. And we're being watched, still. Another metal pipe. That's good. I'm making a lot of noise. Oh, he's on fire! <laughs> Enemies killed by fire. I didn't even do that on purpose. Does he have loot on him? He does. Oh my gosh, he had a sausage roll. I don't think it's a good idea to eat a sausage roll off of a dead zombie corpse, but you know, that's just me. Although we don't actually eat, eat them, I guess. Small purse. Watch out for the fire. All right, more change. Wait, we can hop this, right? Yeah. Edith the Vaulter. Jeez. Maybe. There we go. Oops, don't do that. That was a mistake. Can I kill another guy with fire? Is that, uh, oh yes. Oh yeah, there you go. Yes! Oh man, I dig it. Look at that. Come on, he's so much on fire right now. There we go. Yes, I approve. Right, let's get in here. Ow! How do I, how do I, no, I'm dead! <laughs> Oh my god. Well, there you have it. There's my first death. It's pretty fantastic. Uh, he's coming to scoop up the, the tasty, well-done uh, entrails. <laughs> cool. All right. Well, there you go. That is a, uh, that's a first look at, um... oh, here we go. That's me dying in a fire. Oh, that's good. That's good. Thanks, game. Thanks. <laughs> That is Welcome to Basingstoke. Actually, just Basingstoke. It, it, it's weird because the title screen is Welcome to Basingstoke, but in my Steam library, it's just Basingstoke. So that's what we're going to call it. Um, I think we'll be uh, we'll doing we'll be doing some more. This isn't going to be like a one-off. Uh, I do want to get in here and, and uh, play a little bit more of this and hopefully not die again. Um, hopefully we won't have to play through the intro again either. Uh, but we'll see. Uh, so far, so good. It's really good. Um, let me know what you think uh, about the series and, and the video and all that. And... Uh, Again, thanks so much for watching, and join me next time.